Okay, so I'm sitting here playing Minecraft, and I keep getting the sensation that I am not down here alone. Um, according to what I see, I am alone, but I don't feel like I am. So, basically I wanted to take this opportunity to share a couple of apps with you guys that I recently downloaded and thought I might give a try. Alright guys, quick detour. It is going to have me rate it, so I'll go ahead and give it a 5. Um, I'm not sure. I don't believe it does. I do not believe you can. And I'm just going to leave it at that. Alright, so we're going to do it. <laughs> All right, random. Okay, so I, I guess there could also be the possibility that the so weak was not in reference towards myself, but perhaps they were implying that they feel weak. If there's something here that would like to speak to me and clarify. The message that I just received saying so weak. Please do so now.
definitely going to have to go back over and listen to these recordings afterwards because I think I'm hearing things coming through here, but I'm not making them out in real time. So I'm definitely going to have to go through and re listen to that. And if you hear anything in this recording, please leave a comment. Let me know. Please feel free to use the nearly 2,000 word database that is in this app. You can pull from the different words to say messages. If I can't understand you through the white noise, please use the database. So it kind of feels like maybe there's something close by me that is possibly picking up the energy to communicate. I'm not sure if maybe using the database, if it requires more energy for them to go through it and pick the proper word, versus just try to speak through the white noise. So that's a possibility at the moment. something's trying to come through, guys. Um, in the meantime, before any other messages maybe come through, I wanted to take a moment and show you. I did try this app a couple of days ago when I first downloaded it, and I played it for approximately a half an hour, and I did get some messages. This is the messages that I received. Or these are the messages, I'm sorry. <laughs> I already know there will be people trying to correct me about that, but I already tried to myself. Ha <laughs> ha. Well, this is a list of the history of the words, and I do believe that we just got a new word that came through. Okay, let's play. That was right. Maybe it's saying I'm right about assuming that it takes more energy to use the database. Or I suppose it could be saying that I was right in assuming about <laughs> the first comment about so weak. I guess it, it could be taken either way depending on how long it is taking them to reply to these questions that I'm asking. something here, and I'm not 100% sure, but I do believe that when those beats are going off as, as they are, as you hear randomly in the recording, I think that that is indicating a higher EVP reading, and I want it to be noted that I am just simply sitting in a chair holding my phone directly in front of me, just as I would if I was reading a text message. So... I just want that to be noted in this recording, um, that I do believe that the beats are an indication of the EVP in the area that is being able to be sensed. And, and I'm not 100% sure, I guess somebody, maybe if they wanted to look into it a little deeper than that, they could go and research and see uh, through this app what um, type of range a person would be able to get in the sensors for an EVP reading. I'm not 100% sure on that about how, how accurate the readings are for, for the footage away from your phone, but I am sitting in a chair holding my phone in front of me, so I'm assuming those beats indicate that something is very close and is, is trying to communicate, and, and, and I suppose when it said right that I could be right about that or something. I'm sorry for speaking in circles, but 
I guess I'm really not sure what to say. <laughs> and and waiting for them to build up the energy to, to say their next message, I suppose. trying to come through were indicating that they were weak. And they were indicating that I was right about assuming they were weak and needing extra strength to speak to the
I'm not sure if that causes any discrepancies. that noise that you hear, it is not actually the radio. The device that I'm holding, it, it basically emits sound similar to a radio, but it's just the static part. It's to help pick up your voice, but I cannot hear you right this moment. Guys, I know it might sound crazy to say this, and I know that this being a free app and all, you would assume that it's just a novelty, but <laughs> this is kind of giving me goosebumps here. to a different app that I have on my phone that I recently downloaded right here. The first app that I was just using is this ghost hunting um, equipment that I have in which you can see here the icon for it is just a hand. So if you are interested in downloading that yourself just go to the Google Play Store type in ghost hunting and see what pops up and look for that icon. The second one I'm going to try now is this ghost sonar. It's supposed to send off a sonar signal that shows me energy moving around me. So, as I've already stated, I am sitting still in a chair. So, let's turn this on real quick and see what we've got going on around me. And as you can see, they are both made by Unity. I've actually noticed a lot of the apps I tend to use are by them, so they must be pretty good at, at making apps. <laughs> takes a second in the upload there. Either that or I could be having technical difficulties, I suppose. Oh, it looks like it's loading. It's just uh, taking a moment there. It's pretty sad when, <laughs> when you go to open an app and the ads get to you before the app does. <laughs> Okay, <laughs> maybe I'll have to back out of that again and try to relaunch it or something. Let's go over here and close that out. 
Try one more time. Come on, ghost sonar. Uh, remind me later. <laughs> Definitely have no problem giving thumbs up to good apps, so I don't ever usually try to say no thanks. Okay. Is it not going to work for us? Okay, this is this is very strange because I, I know for a fact that this app works. I turned this app on the other day as well as the other one that I originally started with and they both worked. So the fact that it's not working right now, it makes me kind of wonder if there's something that says no. Don't pay attention to the sonar right now. I want to talk to you guys. So I'm going to hop back over here to the ghost hunting app and see if we get something that might be coming through. It's worth a try, right? You never know what you might catch. <laughs> Alright, whoa. trying to prevent me from accessing the sonar or to get me to come back onto the app so that you could speak to me and to other people to talk to me. Okay guys, and as you notice immediately upon asking this question, I am getting deep. So, that as I said, I believe is an indication that there's something near me. And the EVP readings are rising. Figuring out that this device I am holding in my hand. Whoa, okay. <laughs> that was strange. Oh, <laughs> I wasn't sure there for a moment if it was crashing or what it was doing, but it's just a, um, Advertisement, so...
going to set this down on the arm of the chair now. that if you do not know love, that you should know love. I'm not sure what's being said here, guys, but I think there's a lot of activity going on here in the white noise, so definitely, definitely interested in playing this back, and also letting you guys hear it and play it back yourselves. And just see if you catch anything. If you hear any replies or responses when I'm asking some of these questions. Um, I know part of the video I'm just being quiet. That's just me giving a chance for something to come through. Or possibly giving it a moment in between. Because as I said earlier, I do understand that it can take them some energy to, to talk to us, and, um, I know definitely that if it was myself, I would need a breather in between sometimes, so, I, I kind of get the causes as well for them.
Definitely a possibility that Megan might hear this. I mean, potentially anyone alive in this world has the opportunity at some point that they could come across this and listen to this. So I am offering any spirits that are here with me even though I know that this device apparently is a nuisance. But I am offering you this opportunity to come speak. Upstairs, or you want me to go upstairs? still getting cold chills guys and like I said it's only on certain parts of my body <laughs> the feeling that some of the spirits here are willing to talk and they are actually intrigued a little bit by the device I have but I think that there are some here that wish it would just go away 
shoes. I want to shoot somebody. <laughs> you see what I mean, guys? There, there definitely seems to be more than just one spirit here. Because, I mean, this just doesn't make sense. It just truly doesn't make sense. I, I'm, I'm hoping and praying that between all of us, we can make some sense of this white noise because these pre-programmed dancers, they don't seem to be working that way. Or I shouldn't say they don't seem to be working that good. It's more like whatever's speaking through them at the moment seems to be negative. Truly, it makes me sad because I know you guys have seen several times I've shared videos, and, and although I have indicated this war between good and evil, or or between the light and the dark, I've also insinuated that it is all about a, a balance between the two things. It is meant to be a balance, and when you find a being, whether they're they're passed away already. Or if they're still alive, and, and you meet somebody that just has this negativity that they carry with them, it, it really makes me sad because I wish that they could just know love or feel that compassion, and, and maybe it could make a difference. could possibly be talking about you. That is a good possibility. I think that love and compassion are some of the greatest things in existence. And they are something that transcends between all realms of existence. Cup. It's lemonade. Do you like lemonade? You buy my cup.
I really feel the need to ask why you feel that way. So much for my possible interaction that I was hoping to get. It's not every day you try to uh, afford a way to bring the, the the realm of the dead, if you will, into the the realm of the living. But in this way of, of trying to record their voice and trying to get them to share messages for anyone that might listen, and, and after doing that, and going through that to afford them that chance, of only seeming to interact mostly with something that is predominantly negative, it's kind of disheartening a little bit, and um, definitely being somebody that even as a child I was able to see spirits, uh, good or bad, um, Throughout my, my years of growing up, I've had several encounters. This one, though, with this app, I will definitely have to say takes the cake because it's just, for me, very heartbreaking for, for me to know that there are beings that exist. That feels so negatively. As whichever being this is that's talking to me and, and speaking of preparing to mutilate, and, and things like that, and speaking of marauding, and, and, and wanting to break devices and cameras, and things like that. It's just negative. And there is a, a chance for those negative beings. As I said, if they were to know compassion and love, there is a way for those negative beings to possibly not be so negative. Guys, I'm going to leave this running for just a couple more minutes, and then I will finish up and wrap up this video, but uh, for the moment, I'm just going to leave it running and, and see if there's any last minute messages that any spirits might want, you know, I guess to send through on this recording. Go ahead and speak into this device that I'm holding. that you want me to give you? The device that I'm holding or love and compassion? Just either say device or compassion. Instilling this with a gutter with that. <laughs> like, is, is this spirit trying to hook up with me or something? <laughs> when, I, when I spoke of compassion and love, I didn't mean sex. <laughs> so, I mean, sex is an expression of compassion and love, but sex within itself is not. <laughs> Yeah. 
better game. Um, like I said, I'm gonna leave this running for just a couple more moments if it's any last minute messages. Please go for it. Oh yeah, that, they definitely must be talking about my coffee table at the moment. My coffee table is littered with papers, receipts, and ashtrays, and cup holders. I have a little container box. on this device. If you download this app, you will see what I mean. Nothing on this device can be altered. For you to manipulate these readings in any way. So, this, to me, definitely seems like a legit app. And it seems to work. Because, I know you guys can't see my writing room right now. So you can't see the clutter on my table. Or the fact that they're really sitting there. But this thing just literally added the word no sense as a change to my list when I'm, I named off things and items that were on my table after it already indicated the word sense. So, you know, just those few items and stuff in me is enough confirmation that this thing works. So, definitely go to the Google Play Store, go to this app, give it a shot. You never know, you might not be alone. guys, I'm about to wrap this up now. Um, I'm going to go ahead and, and give a shout out tonight to all of my spirits here with me. Um, as I already said, I'm, I'm under the impression that there's definitely more than one. So, I want to give a shout out good night to them. And I want to give a shout out good night to all my followers. And even though I know it's going to be morning by the time you see this, because of course I have to edit and get it ready and upload for YouTube. So by the time I do that, it's going to be in the wee hours of the morning. So it's good night for me right now. So <laughs> just leave it at good night. And everybody have a good night. And I hope in playing this back, somebody maybe hears something or is able to deduct something from this that maybe I wasn't able to hear in real time. And I'm going to go ahead and in this video, I guess. I'm sorry for the <laughs> exit being so long, but 
I keep hearing this beeping coming and going like it keeps coming back and then leaving again. So I'm not 100% sure if there's something that has some, you know, one last minute thing that they want to say. But definitely if that's the case, go ahead and say it right now. Well, that was, <laughs> I'm assuming that the, they are indicating that their name is Jim. Hello, Jim. I would, I suppose it would be polite to say that I, it, it's a pleasure to meet you. I hope that you're not that negative. And I'm so sorry guys, I know I said I was ending this video, but I, I just knew something was still trying to come through, and I couldn't finish off the video and, and end it without letting it come through first. Thank you for letting me know. Um, we'll do this again some other time. <laughs> Alright. Thank you guys. Thank you, Spirit, uh, for communicating with me today. And thank you, Jim. Um, a shout out, I guess, to Megan as well. There was another name that was mentioned. I know when I, I, I did this the other day, there was a name on there that was Lily in. Uh, so I'm not sure if that's the name of another spirit that's here or not, but shout out to L uh, Lillian, and, uh, you guys have a good night, and you, you Jim, you said you were done, so, so we got one more message coming through from you, Jim. Break free. <laughs> you want to break free. You can break free. If you mean of the negativity and if you feel like you are trapped in this, this state of existence, you can break free, Jen. And if that's the reason why you feel so negative, is because you feel trapped and stuck, please know that there is a way. There is a way. Um, so now though, guys, I'm going to go ahead and end this video. 
uh, I, I might go ahead even after I end this video, I might keep this up rolling for a little while though, just to see if anything else happens, and even though it won't be recorded, I will let you guys know later on if anything else happens. So have a good night, and definitely please comment below, let me know anything throughout this whole recording, if you, if you call anything, any EVPs, please let me know. <laughs> And okay, maybe I'm not ending it yet, but we might be on the to one more time. <laughs>